Good evening, this is more fit helping you get fit. We're back here with another video. Today is gonna be a full fledged chest workout. What I normally do on a chest on chest day. Uh, so I'm gonna be doing six exercises. You will see all the sets and reps and everything, so follow through. This is what I do for my regular chest uh, workout almost every day. But sometimes, of course, I change the weights, change the uh, order of the exercises and everything, but these are like my staple chest exercises. Yeah, six of them. We'll start with the flat bench press, barbell, barbell inclined bench press, then dumbbell inclined bench press, dumbbell inclined flies, and cable flies, then I'll finish off in the Smith machine with another flat bench and just get it cracking. Let's go! So yeah, what you just saw me do is uh, just stretching, man. getting the blood, getting ready, getting, you wanna always stretch, you don't wanna just jump up lifting weights because your joints, your muscles, everything is just cold, you know, so you always want to make sure you get a good stretch, break a sweat. If you scream like that, you can increase your strength to 0.0%. So always scream. Now, that's it for this exercise. We're going to exercise number two. Uh, still a barbell press but with incline to work your upper, upper chest, upper part of your chest. Like I said, king of chest exercises is the flat bench press. It works your chest overall, but after that you still want to work your chest, I mean, a little bit isolated, just to get a fully developed chest, not just, you know, the flat bench, of course. So now to work on the upper chest, you can see most people are lacking in that area. We're gonna go do some barbell press on the incline bench. Let's do it. Do it for YouTube, boy. So here, I'm gonna just put on 100 kg on the bar and maybe get 5 sets of 5. Who knows? I don't know man. I don't know how many sets or how many reps I'm gonna do. All I know is I'm gonna do all that I can possibly do. So, and that's all you need to do really. You don't need to count the numbers. You don't need to count the reps. Just do as many as you possibly can do. The only reps you don't grow from is the reps you didn't do. So, do your thing, baby! Ooh. I'll give you guys a tip with the bench press. This exercise is really good, but you can easily get injured in your shoulders. A lot of people, most of the people that really lift weights have shoulder problems. But to kind of help prevent that, when you lie down on the bench, don't just open up and start pressing, no. You lie down there, retract your shoulder. Make sure you retract your shoulder blades, get them really positioned. That way when you lift, use your chest more, your muscles, not your joints, because you don't want to hurt that 
good head of out, you know, it's gonna prevent you from training properly. That's the worst feeling when you get injured and you cannot train properly for some time. You lose all your gains. Do my talking, but I care about you guys. So I give you the tips so you don't get injured. Make sure you subscribe, man. Stop playing. Stop playing. Maybe the 100 kg, maybe we can do 110. Let me add 10 kgs on there, man. You have to push yourself. That's all the way you grow, man. Don't just be comfortable. I'm doing 100 kgs. That's, that's good way on the incline. But I feel like maybe I can put myself in a position where I struggle a little bit. But that way you grow. Listen, man, this is very important. 100 kgs is good weight on the incline bench press but if you want to grow you want to always push more push a little bit more every every kilo you add can make a difference so i feel like i can add 10 kgs and still be safe so i'll do it why not we're here to grow man hard man but it prepares you for life out there man when you push when you put yourself through all this hardship you go outside there and there, there is a lot of traffic you don't cry man that's little shit <laughs> or you go to the coffee shop and they serve you cappuccino when you order cafe latte you won't cry because that's nothing you already been so much shit. So training is not just about physical, it also just helps you to be tougher mentally, you know. Because it has to be in here first before it comes outside. So really it's not just about building muscles man, you're building building your inner strength too. Without that inner strength, you won't be able to do this. There's nobody here watching me I could cheat you know there's somebody behind the camera so I had to I mean I mean this but I'm saying I'm doing this I'm just doing this for myself man nobody's pushing me so I could just do two three reps and go home but no even if I'm tired I still stay here and do what I have to do and what I plan the way I plan my season it has to finish that way nothing less you know so that just kind of helps you to be more determined and dedicated on whatever you're doing. You know, so let's get it. Six exercises. You on the second one? Four more to go. <laughs> For the barbell incline press, we're done with that. We're done with the bar. Two exercises. So I'm gonna hit two exercises with the dumbbell. Then hit the cables. Like I said, you don't want to go to the cables and waste your time there. That's, a, that's for finishing. After you do all these heavy weights with lots of sets and repetitions, then you can use the cables just to, to finish up your workout. You know, it also helps maybe in the shaping of your chest, but not really growing it. You want your chest to grow or any muscle. Make this your best friend, the barber.
Hey. Uh, exercise number five. We'll do some cable flies now. Chest is dead. We're gonna kill it some more with some flies. Here you don't wanna really go heavy, you just wanna go nice. Not too heavy weight, just weight that you can really control. Focus on getting as many reps as possible with nice form. You can do it standing or kneeling down. You can adjust this to different positions. So it's good to be able to just change your, the variation of your exercise. Still the same, but you just do it in a different way. So today, I'll do it standing. And then a few steps sitting down or kneeling down. So yeah, that's it man, that's like one of my standard chest routines, six exercises, flat bench, start with maybe anywhere from six to eight sets, and then the rest of the five exercises, the same thing, mostly five sets, or at most six sets, but I don't do anything less than five sets on any exercise. It's not about doing 20 exercises in the gym. Even if you do three solid exercises with lots of repetitions, lots of uh, sets, lots of reps, that's fine. You don't need to come to the gym and touch every single machine here. Just stick to like five or six solid exercises for the muscle group you're training, and that should be fine. So stay tuned, subscribe. Hope this video gets a lot better than the other one. And if you watch it. Just please subscribe man, you know what, pause the video, subscribe right now, let's give them some seconds to subscribe, subscribe, yeah, okay, cool, so thanks, thanks for subscribing, if I check and you don't, I'll come to your house and subscribe for you, alright? Yeah, that's my <laughs> new style, man. You know, just felt like doing something different a little bit. That's cool. It's been the same old, same old, man. Yeah. So felt like you know, let's get it right. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So next time I'm gonna go full color. Maybe I'll change the color, red, blue, green, something like that. You never know what I will do. So just stay tuned, man. Yeah. Bye. Alright. Yeah. Peace.